Now he's running for U.S. president, but may already be the king of Twitter. Donald Trump's quest for the Republican presidential nomination is being feared in part by his reliance and dominating presence on social media. His tweets make news nearly every day. Hendrik Sprandy looks at the Trump Twitter phenomenon. Donald Trump is a master of the declarative sentence. I am going to be. He is clear. The greatest jobs president. He is concise. That God ever created. He speaks in sound bites. He is a media mastermind. He is a sound bite candidate. Wow, Senator Cruz, that is some low-level ad you did using a picture of Melania in a GQ shoot. Be careful, or I will spill the beans on your wife. Trump is using social media like no politician has before. He doesn't have a filter, and that works really well on Twitter. Says Samuel J. of Metropolitan State University of Denver. I mean, that spreads. Fellow social media expert Matthew Keskevich says Donald Trump's tweets stand out because they trigger high arousal emotions. The content that he posts traditionally goes around two things: um, shock and surprise. And fear. If I... This veteran of reality television knows how to grab the traditional media's attention. Even if the headline says doesn't Derrigan say Silver the of the University of Denver. All he has to do is he has to tweet something really outrageous the night before. Boom. He's now not only in front of the public, but he's sucking up airtime that could be used to cover other candidates or other topics or other policies. The approach has worked, at least in terms of numbers. Trump's over 31,000 tweets, one more provocative than the other, have garnered well over 7 million Twitter followers. Followers. Saying something stupid does not hurt Trump. Certainly not with his followers, who by retweeting his messages, experts say, help solidify his support. Trump's Twitter base is just so massive that it's not just what he says, but once it's out there, they do the work for him. Trump's tweets are now a part of pop culture, getting big laughs when singer Josh Groban put them to music on late night television. Never seen a thin person drinking Diet Coke. In a year when U.S. voters crave authenticity in their candidates, Donald Trump is providing it 140 characters at a time. I would like to extend my best wishes to all, even the haters and losers, on this special date, September 11th. I make it may not win him the White House, but campaigns may never be the same. Those people that love him love him for the tweets, and that's part of the reason they love him. Hendrick Sabrandi, CCTV, Denver.